Larry and Debbie Barnes are serious golfers. Well, Larry and I play in about 12 to 15 couple scrambles a year. You know, we go wherever there's an event because we really enjoy playing in them. Like the Barnes, Mike Kane and his wife also participate in couples golf, but finding events were a challenge. So we had to depend on other people that we met to tell us about other events we could play in. And then the more we did that and met new people and great people at, at uh, those events that we played in, we found out they were suffering the same from the same uh, malady. And uh, that's where I uh, got the idea that uh, there was a place for uh, a central resource, a central source of information on those things. The United States Couples Golf Association grew from their efforts, and it was only natural to host an end-of-the-year tournament to crown a national champion. It's one of the outstanding things about couples events is you meet so many great people from around the country. The competition was as competitive as the participants were colorful. We've got uh, couples from six different states. Uh, some of them we knew uh, from the outset. Uh, others we've met through the association here. And some we met here for the very first time. The barn survived the wind, the crowd, and the competition to walk away with a handsome prize. I know what you're thinking. The Barnes are from West Tennessee, home course advantage, but that was not the case as they've only played at Pitwick three times this entire year. It's a great event and we're just happy to be the first ones to win it. 